morning, Cobra Gabbana. We're back on our deck chairs. I'm wearing my Titan Bet hat, but obviously my Argentina shirt. Um, when America play, I can turn it back and fit in with them. Um, the beach is getting packed again. They're amazing sport. I'll get some videos for you in a bit. Uh, I'm going to go Argentina win. That's a 3-2, 28 to 1 on Titan Bet. So that's a uh, pretty pricey returns. Um, as I say, they sing the whole time. We'll get some footage when they score goals, but it's getting busy already if you have a look. So, 0-0 half-time, Argentina-Switzerland, quite a similar game to the Iran game actually. 0-0, um, don't look great, all at sea in the last third and very reliant on Messi. Uh, Levethi doesn't look up to scratch and Di Maria, well, it's been terrible tournament again, not playing well. And Switzerland haven't been without their chances. They had a good effort from top D but was straight at the keeper and near the end of the first half, Dermic um, straight through and goal and tried a terrible chip. If he had gone low and hard to the keeper's near post, I think Switzerland would be 1-0 up. Um, Shakiri is incredible. He's beating players the whole time. Not quite the goal fest I predicted, but it is close. And um, that's what I thought may happen. And Argentina have to be careful here because they're very reliant on Messi. And he's been marked well so far. So the forward to the second half. The fans are still quite nervous. But if they get a goal, I'll definitely bring you their amazing reaction. Enjoy the second half. The nil nil, And that's the fourth of seven last 16 games going to extra time. Fans a little bit nervous. They definitely dominated that second half. Switzerland defended a bit and maybe playing for penalties now. But um, yeah, it was uh, not a very convincing display again from Argentina. They didn't look good going forwards and rely on Messi too much. So we could be saying goodbye to them perhaps.